Hi, Jamie Ruby, Sci-Fi Vision. Thanks for talking to us today. So what was it, though, particularly about each of your characters that you connected with right away when you read the scripts for both of you? I, I really connected with this woman's need to be on and need to be, uh, I don't want to use any descriptive, but she's she's got a very tough job, and I think she does so with, very much like a you know obviously in, intelligence uh but grace and dignity i i hope and but within that on top of that we see the pressure that she has because she has a boss too and mm -hmm. that's an a very interesting layer that i i really can tap into <laughs> yeah and for me it was i mean i played the the president of Czechia, so uh, a politician who probably ha had a past in politics, and then we meet her at the point where she's like on the top of her game, and she's a very calm, collected, very intelligent, witty, uh, fun person in a way, you know. And and then at the very beginning, as it should happen in the Jack Ryan universe, something happens, and her whole world blows apart. And not only her world, she actually has to get to grips with whatever decision she is making potentially as the outcome of a third world war, you know. So the stakes are very high <laughs> this time. And the way how she's being written and what on a personal level is being thrown at her at the same time and how she deals with it and how she handles herself, like, like Betty says, I hope my character also has this kind of dignity and but but strong mindedness you know that she makes the right decisions at the right time because she she has the guts to follow her instincts and not listening to anyone else right uh, that that I, I really loved about the character both of your characters obviously have really important jobs in different ways but can you sort of talk about specifically the the prep and, and like the research side of it that you both did to kind of to you know fill those shoes? Well, I was basically lucky enough. My my from my background, uh, my father was a politician and so was in parliament in the German parliament for eight years. And as a child, I kind of entered that world through him, and kind. Of, kind of got to learn about the the back world of politics that you see in public you know and how things are being discussed and actually choice decisions come to fruition and and all of that so i was basically more leaning on the script to be honest because it was so well written my character on a personal level but also on the way how she was portrayed as a politician and how she deals with all the men that are entering her office, basically. How she handles them informed me of what kind of a, I thought she's a very good politician because she, she's highly intelligent, she knows a lot, um, but she also can draw from her instinct and she relies on her instinct, which when I see the women out there that are in politics and then that may be also helming nations, they, uh, they have that kind of quality. They also, they have a very specific personality to themselves that no one can rattle on, <laughs> you know? So I, I, uh, I wanted to give that to, to Elena. Ready? I had the honor of um, having many conversations with a former CIA officer who is um, also a young black woman, and it was it was so rewarding and so useful to to hear her stories um, and to hear how her background, her upbringing, her exposure to other cultures was such an asset for her in within the organization um, and on all the challenges that she's faced being in this predominantly white male <laughs> organization and so it yeah i was really fortunate to have her as a resource i was introduced to her by wendell pierce um who was an extraordinary person to to 
uh, have as a resource as well. Great, thank you so much. Thank you.